hello everybody today i'll be taking a tutorial on how to install open crate in your local host that is editing and working on your open crate site from your system i'll be taking a tutorial on how to install it on the system in your local host first of all i guess you all have zamp installed if you don't you go online download the app called zamp then after downloading and installing this the app the first thing you do is to start your ZAMP. I have to start my Okay, now I have my start. And you start your Apache and my SQL. My is already started here. Then you go back. I guess you have uh, download the this the oh shit I have multiple I guess you all have downloaded the bitnami open create modulus modulus for example that is what I will be using I'm not using a open create using I'm not using the open create zip file I'm using the modulus to install it in my example so making use of this open crate modulus you, you shall use modul sorry modul bitnami please know that zamp is made by bitnami and also you can cut it i'm making use of this bitnami open crate modul and that is what I will advise you make use of. Click on next and select the folder my my ZAMP is installed in this particular place so that I will not be having any restriction by Windows. Then click on next. You will be asked to input a login, your username and blah blah blah. Just create any password you feel like. Anything you feel like, I'm saying Victor at gmail.com. Click on next. Okay, if you want to learn more about Bitnami Cloud hosting, you're good to go. But for me, I'm not. I click on next. Next, prepare to install. Please note that before you can be able to install this open crates, you, your MySQL must be on. At you have to start it first. And if you have any problem with your PID, as your Apache port, I advise you go to this com configuration here. Over here, you change the port to any port you let me say if you want to go with 80 because 80 is the default but i have to change mine to 8080 due to the fact that another app is already making use of it so you just close it here you just change it here you may change it here too as if you have any problem i also change it in this particular place server name then you save it and close it you can see my I've stopped okay then you go back to configuration then you change it here also and save but this one is just due to all those password stuff I have to input a new password when I'm creating a database in my bitnami That's the reason why the Apache crashed. Okay, let's launch it. 
the reason why this site is not opening now is because their battery is not on now so i have to start the battery first so first i try what i try to do is to see if to see the error where the error is coming from i notice that it's coming from this pid 4900 so you go over to this place you right click task manager go to your task manager here and you go click on detail then you check for the pid and here is it i guess this is the stuff that i stopped it this control panel here if you go over to this side you see it and from yeah let us close this tab and you see it it starts now okay let's start it now start yeah it's good to go now so we'll go back to this place and you click on it you still having the same problem please know that my local host i edited it to 8080 due to the fact that i'm having problem with the port so you go to your url here to check if your distance is working you go to this place add me what you have to do first is to create a database I have a Vietnam database here for open grid. I want to create another one. I want to create a new database because I will be instructed to have to add a new database. So new database. You click on new, then go here and write. For me, I will click write open create and you create it. Okay. Let's go to the privilege to check the user there. And for what you can see here, we we have how many we have on the local host we have a user PMA. So I'll go back to the batch. I click on the admin. Then I'll go to application and you can see the Vietnamese open create module is here. So you access it. Now we start installation of our open crate. Everything is okay in this place. Go down. Continue. Okay. The username. Please note that you have if you go to this place, you notice that in the database I created, the new database, this particular one, the open crate database, we have a user there who is P A M P M A. If you want to create a new user, you go here. Add new user. Victor host. Local host. Password. Um, password. I will leave it blank for now. Let me write it. So, I will leave it blank for now. So, you grant or privileges on that uh, uh, that database crates then check this to make the user a super user and go to go okay since you have to put the password what password will I use one two three four five six seven okay one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Go. Wow. You have added a new user. They will come here. Click on Victor. Password. database open create everything is okay here and by default the username here will be admin but you can change to everything anything you want 
So I'll make my admin and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. The installation is complete. So, right here, let's say, we should not forget to delete our installation directory. So, let's go log into your admin. You try to log in. Oh, sorry, admin. Password. So, yeah, you log in. Wow. Okay, warning. Install folder says it and should be deleted for security reasons. Okay, we have to exam app. You go to the app, then open create the HT docs. Then this folder should be deleted. You delete the folder. I try to reload it. And you can see the error message is not meant here. Okay. Now you have your your site ready. Go to this URL. Your site URL. That's what you have here. Huh? Wow. So you now have your open credits site ready all you have to do now is to start editing putting your templates and everything you want to put so I guess if you want your own e-commercial site you want to prepare yours offline without being online you can make use of this just try to get ZAMP and also your Bitnami okay thank you and next time we meet. Bye.